Hey guys, this is my son and welcome to my son and Hassan Academy. So today I am going to discuss few general aptitude questions. Basically these are uh, really important for Niper ZW. Okay, if any aspirant watching this video, whoever is going to give, give Niper ZW exam tomorrow. So it uh, this type of things are really important general aptitude. Four to five question at least you will face it. Okay, or more than five question also you may get it. So uh, you have to be serious about four to five question. Okay, it is not so easy. Like uh, now, this competition in a level like even one mark matters a lot. Okay, so I'm just uh, telling this thing very firstly. Try to listen it very carefully. Okay, so this uh, general aptitude it's not uh, like only Niper Z only. Even uh, the student who who are preparing for CUET, uh, if you are not qualified GPET or even you qualified GPET, you have to crack CUET for Central University. Okay, so for in CUET they are asking 25 question from general aptitude. So for you also going to help. I already make one video that came in UPSC this year, uh, and these are some topic I'm going to discuss here. Okay, so first topic is like uh, angle between two hands. So this is they are basically asking when they are asking clock related question. Okay, so uh, suppose uh, you can imagine any time like 6:20 or 7:20. So this is the time, and then what is the angle? between our hands and minute hands so they are asking this type of question okay you may think that you uh, by imagining you can find out yes sometimes you can find out but not that easy so if you know the formula that will be the best for you okay otherwise you can go through like uh, calculation whole clock is 360 degree suppose you forgot formulas then how you will find out whole clock is 360 degree and that is divided to 12 different parts okay so each part is uh, 30 degree and this way you can find out but for exact answer sometimes you required uh, formula or you need very uh, uh, very sharp calculation then only you will get exact answer okay so this type of uh, question whenever you get this formula you remember theta is equal to half of 60 h minus 11 m H means me, uh, hours hand and M means minute hands. Okay, so just time I am taking at 7:20. You can take any random time and just put here 16 to 7 uh, minus 11 into 20. So whatever it is, just put here and you will get at the end 100 degree. So just at the end uh, uh, you can uh, check this way. You write any. Uh, you just put any. A different time and find out the angle and see it is correct or not okay so this type of question you may get and it is uh, really important it is asking every everywhere okay this year in upsc prelims also also they ask clock related uh, problem so many one taking it very uh, lightly they think that uh, these are not that important and all but it's asking ne next question or next uh, one question you may get from here percentage okay percentage is very common in everywhere so basically whenever we talk about percentage is what it really means uh, it is uh, related to 100 suppose you got uh, you got 700 marks out of 1000 marks in a competitive exam or somewhere so what uh, how much percentage you got you got 70 percent because when we compare with uh, 1000 then it is 700 but if we reduce that for 100 then it is 70 once we compare with 100 then it become percentage otherwise it is not percentage okay and there is something called percentile that is different thing so don't confuse between percentage and percentile that's totally uh, different things so how you have to find out percentage like uh, some percentage are very easy but some percentage you should uh, you will uh, confuse because they are asking 61 percent of 50 suppose if they anyone uh, ask you 50 percent of this is how much you can easily find out this is the half of that amount okay so if you have one liter 50 percent means half liter this way you can find out but if anyone say that uh, you have uh, 50 liters of milk and what is the 61 percent of this milk then you will it will take time but if you know formula it will be very easy okay suppose uh, 61 percent of 50 they are asking the answer is 30.5 so how i will got it the formula is x percent of y is equal to y percent of x what it means suppose you are telling that 20 percent of 30 same way you can tell in vice versa like 30 percent of 20 is equal to 20 percent of 30 okay so these two things is very uh, vice versa okay like uh, you don't know 61 percent of 50 but you know it that 50 percent of 61 is how much 30.5 and that is your answer so this way you can find out very easily like 80 percent of 90 they are asking and uh, you are feeling a uh, little bit uh, difficulty to find out this answer so what you have to do just 
मल्टीप्लाई दिस टू नंबर एंड डिवाइडेड बाई हंड्रेड एट एट नाइन जा सेवेंटी टू सेवेंटी टू टू जीरो इज देयर एंड दैट इज जस्ट कट बाई टू हंड्रेड टू जीरो सो एंसर इज सेवेंटी टू ट्वेंटी परसेंट ऑफ थर्टी इज वन टू इंटू थ्री जा सिक्स टू जीरो इज कट बाई हंड्रेड सो दिस इज द इजी टिक टू फाइंड आउट सम क्वेश्चन समटाइम्स दे आर आस्किंग दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन ओके और समटाइम दे आर दे विल गिव लाइक यू बहुत समथिंग मोबाइल फोन इन सेवन थाउजेंड एंड यू सेल इट इन सेवन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड सो वट इज योर परसेंटेज ऑफ प्रॉफिट ऑल दिस थिंग सो एट दैट टाइम यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट आउट देयर एंड जस्ट कंपेयर विथ हंड्रेड so okay don't leave this type of question because if you think that uh, this question is going to give i ha- hardly two marks and it will take time i i, I don't want to find out but due to two marks your rank will be uh, lot of lot of rank uh, you will decrease you uh, deduct and you will, at the end you won't get top sniper okay for everyone fighting for top थ्री टू फोर नाइपर बेसिकली टॉप थ्री नाइपर दैन नाइपर गुवाहाटी ऑल्सो गुड तो थ्री टू फोर नाइपर ऑल्सो ओनली देयर वेयर एवरी वन वॉन्ट्स टू गो देयर ओके सो बी सीरियस अबाउट इट एंड फाइव फॉर इवन वन मार्क्स ओके इफ यू यूर वन आवर और फाइव मिनट स्टडी कैन इंक्रीज वन वन मार्क दैट इज वेरी हेल्पफुल सो लेट सी वन मोर क्वेश्चन दे आर आस्किंग बेसिकली दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन परफेक्ट स्क्वायर सो वॉट इज द परफेक्ट स्क्वायर बेसिकली सिक्स What is the square of six? Thirty-six. Seven forty-nine. Ten hundred. Hundred is the square. Okay, so hundred is called perfect square. So this way they will give one number uh, like uh, one twenty-three or anything they can may give one forty-four. Easy. They uh, they won't give three digit. They will give a long one so that you are confused. Okay, if they give three digit, you will uh, find out very easily. So they will give a. Uh, Five to six digit even, and you have to tell that whether it is a perfect uh, square or not. So there is a trick. If you know it, you will find out. Uh, no matter even it ten digit or whatever, you will it will take hardly ten to ten to five sec five to ten second only. So what you should know, this number suppose one twenty three. I am just telling by this number one twenty three is there. This three is the last digit. Okay, and this is called unit digit. and this 2 is 10th digit and this 1 is 100th digit okay so in hindi it is saying something uh, different uh, people who is from hindi background they also know understand what is this all this thing okay so uh, this is unit digit 10th digit 100th digit so you have to uh, take care about uh, unit digit mostly okay so if any number last digit is 2 3 7 or 8 then that number never can be a perfect square okay just uh, mug up this thing 2 3 7 Eight. That number is not a uh, perfect uh, square at all. Okay. Then zero, one, two. Then what is that? Five, six, and nine. So this will. If this number are present, then it can be a perfect square. But you have to be sure by confirming the ten digit. What what will be the ten digit? For zero, ten digit also be zero. Like hundred. Hundred is a perfect square. So two zero is there. Like for one, always ten uh, digit will be even. For two, it will be always like even. And to- for five, it will be. Uh, for four, it will be not two. For four, it will be even. For five, it will be always two. Like twenty five, six twenty five. All are ten uh, digit is two in case of five. Then for in case of six. 10 digit is odd in case of 9 10 digit is even okay just take screenshot it will help you a lot then at the end i want to discuss one more uh, last question or can time so how will find out suppose i am giving two name here randomly uh, hasan can do a work in five this what no two this okay it is uh, mirror image that's it and uh, just i take a random name waya can do the same or in six days if they are together how uh, how many days it will take to finish the org so sometimes you may feel difficulty suppose hasan and waya together do the orgs x days just take it as x then 1 by x is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 6 so this, uh, this at the end find out the x that will be the answer so 3 by 2 is equal to 1 by 5 just take lcm here 1 by 5 is the time okay just mug up this formula 1 by x equal to uh, 1 by whatever they are giving two times just do uh, plus it and take the lcm and at the end find out x value that is your answer 1.5 this okay this is too easy and uh, too helpful for you so that's all from my side if you want to take a screenshot you can take it and uh, that's That's all. Uh, thank you for watching this video and keep sharing this type of video. And this uh, video is really going to helpful uh, for you. That's all from my side. Good luck for exam. Uh, that's.